David Andrew Monroe, also known as Brother of Victoria St. Mark, passed away on Monday, 16th January, at the age of 59. He was the close and dear friend of Janet Fraser, father of Nikhil in the USA, Nikisha and Nikita Paul in Grenada, stepfather of Keisha Bernard in Canada, grandfather of Kyrie, Zora and Zanaki Paul, father-in-law of Charlene Paul in the USA, brother of Geraldine, Mava, Sean and Sharon in the UK, Alistair, Carol and Winifred in the USA. Martha in Tobago, Stephen in Barbados, Ruth, Ruthlyn, Peter, Willis, Jacqueline, Beggs, Joycelyn, Alistair, Katie, Rebecca, and Sanita in Grenada. Nephew of Ginger, Vita, Maros, and Nathaniel. Uncle of many including Donnie, Donna, Akira, Samantha, Nevron, Nana, Avanel, Carlson, and PC Odison Fraser. Many cousins including Natasha, Clara, and Francis Monroe. Macosta Charles, John, Linton, Teacher Jennifer Clement, Jenny, Denrick, and Heston. Caregivers, Delcy Philip, and Malika Patrick. Many other relatives and friends in the UK, USA, Canada, and Grenada including Jenny Joseph, past and present executive and members of GFA and Hurricane Sports Club, Grassroots Football Club, the football fraternity in Grenada, Wayne Francis, Dorset McKell, Finley Fletcher, Barrington, Mrs. Clarice Modest, and Julie Dubois, Peter Shala, Andrew and family, Taisha Paul, the Monroe, Charles Fraser, Clement, Paul and Mitchell families of Victoria, Glenda Frederick and family, Chester Alfred and family, friends and neighbors of Coast Guard, Diamond, Waltham, and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late David Andrew Monroe, also known as Brother of Victoria St. Mark, will take place on Wednesday, 8th March at 1 p.m. The funeral service will be held at the Victoria RC Church St. Mark and interment will be at the Coast Guard Cemetery. Funeral arrangements have been entrusted to Lacroix Brothers Funeral Home. Nazra Lewis of Brazan, who resided at Mount Rush St. George, passed away on Wednesday, 15 February 2023, at the age of 46, left to mourn her, her common law husband, Julian Frederick, sisters Sheena Lewis, Sally and Lewis Haynes, Angela Lewis Joseph, Doisel Lewis Amede, and Catherine Regis in the USA, brother Kelvin Lewis. Nieces and nephews Delon and Nazim Lewis, Sunil Samuel, Deshawn, Shema and Skylar Amede, Delia Joseph, and Ariana Regis in the USA. Brothers-in-law Martin Haynes, Shane Amede, Delvin Joseph, and Henry Regis in the USA. Aunts and uncles Gloria and Joseph Lewis, Laurel, Lorna, Violet, Ledon, and Kester. Other relatives and friends including Cuthbert, Jade and Tiffany in England, Senator Claudette Joseph and Neilon Franklin, the Lewis family of Brazan, the Joseph family of Brazan and in the UK, the Watts family in the USA, Joy and Roland, Nurse Simone Cador, Brainman and Gaia Bernard, Novi Alexis, and friends and neighbors of Brazan and Monkrush and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Nezra Lewis of Brazan who resided at Mount Rush St. George, will take place on Wednesday, 8th March at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Garden of Remembrance Funeral Chapel, Cemetery Hill St. George's, and interment will be at the Wilberforce Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Tilda Monica Seethal, also known as Miss Bain, of George V Street, Grenville St. Andrew, passed away on Friday, 17th February 2023 at the age of 91. She was the mother of O'Brien and Lincoln in Grenada, Merlene and Winston in the USA, sister of Louie, Sheila, George, Eric, Norbert, Franklin, Carly, Kenneth, and William Salem. Grandmother of 13, including Brian, Damon, Brent, Sabrina, Camilla, and Samantha. Great-grandmother of four. Aunt of many, including Purdy, Jerry, and Jamie Salem, mother-in-law of Brenda and Michelle, sister-in-law of Maudlin Ratchman 
and Glenda Salem. Many other relatives and friends, including Frances, Miss Florentina Noel, employees of Seathell's block plant, employees of Seathell's imports and distribution, the Salem, Nayak, Ramdani, and Budlal families, and friends and neighbors of George V. Street, Grenville, and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Tilda Monica Seathell, also known as Miss Bean, of George V. Street, Grenville, St. Andrew, will take place on Wednesday, March 8th at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Grenville Pentecostal Lighthouse and interment will be at the Grand Bra Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Darius Nicholas, also known as Zebu and Owl of Calist St. George, died on Tuesday, 21st February 2023 at the age of 56. Left to mourn his passing are his adopted mother and aunt, Angelica Nicholas Belgrave, stepfather Martin Francis, 12 brothers and sisters, Bosanio Nicholas, Portia Nicholas, Delia Ephraim and Antigua, Max Sand, Desiree Skeet in Barbados, Brick Sand, Daria Marast, Christopher, George, Philip, Georgia and Charles, 31 nieces and nephews including Todd, Reandria, Redon, Aria, Alex, Jamin, Doran, Jamie, Jamelia, Ramona, Janique, and Angelique. Many aunts and uncles, including Dennis Fletcher, Bernadette Alexander, Nelson Nicholas, and Mary Belgrave. In-laws Jacqueline Nicholas and Albert Marast. Other family members and friends, Cindy, Sanaya, Ezra, Paula, Nell, Nathalie, Juan, Francisca, Nerissa, Claudia, Lester, Patsy, Leve, Anisita, Destiny, Bull, Arlene Redhead, and family, the boys and girls under the rubber tree, all the people of Kilist, the Nicholas, Fletcher, Belgrave, Philip, and Duncan families of St. Patrick, Gwove, St. Paul's, the Limes, Kilist, and surrounding areas. The funeral service for the late Darius Nicholas, also known as Zebu and Owl, of Calist St. George will take place on Wednesday, March 8th at 1.30 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Our Lady of Mount Carmel R.C. Church Calist, followed by interment at the Family Cemetery Calist. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Magdalene Lalit, also known as Magdalene Tillock, of Cornet's Walk, Wharf, who resided at Clogy St. John, passed away on Wednesday, 1st March 2023 at the age of 77. She was the sister of Rosalind Quarty, Simon Gunpot, and Fenton Boothu in England, and Vernon Abreu in the USA, aunt of many in Grenada, the USA, England, and Barbados, including Anne-Marie Mason, Laura, Louise, Rosalie, and Gloria Mangle, Peggy Benjamin, Pansy and Holly Halal, Sharon Peters, Shirley Ann Harford, Israel Gunpot, Crystalline Pasady, Raleigh and Ronnie Duncan, Nicole Duncan Chance, Pansy Griffith, Chrislyn Charles, Pamela Benjamin, Winnie Benjamin, Eurus Segrest, Shirley Benjamin, and Margaret Ned, sister in law of Leulin Duncan and Eslyn Lalit, grand aunt of many including Brenda Lee and Brendan Duncan, Harry and Mark Mangle, many other relatives and friends including Rosalind Lucas, Ruthlyn Benjamin, the Baldio family of Wharf, Lynette Narine, Freddie Sanderson, Sister Bud, the Mangle, Halal, and Muller families of Cloger, Oslin Thomas, Dario Alexander, the pastors and members of the Gwarv and Cloger Seventh day Adventist churches, and friends and neighbors of Cloger and Gwarv. The funeral of the late Magdalene Lalit, also known as Magdalene Tillock, of Cornet's Walk Gwarv, who resided at Cloger St. John will take place on Wednesday, March 8th at 2 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Gwarv Seventh-day Adventist Church and entombment will be at the Douglaston Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Sybil Gulbin Matthew, also known as Mami Nodge, of Moran St. John, passed away on Sunday, 12th February 2023, at the age of 87. She was the mother of Brian, Moses, Johnny, Errol, Michael, George, Frank and Trinidad, Cecilia, Shirley, Mona, Alice, Claudette, and Loris, grandmother of 54, including Sean, Harriet, 
Brittany, Arlene, Steve, Venice, David, Damien, Mikel, Jude, Rena, Janelle, Jimmy, Junior, Jerry, Ryan, Samantha, Sammy, Shalisha, Shadona, Michael, and Brian. Great grandmother of 24, including Garvin, Dion, Tyler, Makila, Liam, Aiden, Aaliyah, Isaiah, John, Jemiah, Elizabeth, and Alexander. Mother in law of Bob Marley, Michael, Simon, Aaron, Rita, Dorothy, and Zalika in Trinidad. Many nieces and nephews, including Lena, Annie, Beal, Toyo, Miriam, Nicole, and Youthlin. Many other relatives and friends, including Roger Williams and family, the Matthew, Tika, Ned, and Bernard families of Moran, the Gulbin family of Concord, Alicia in the USA, Catherine, the Merger, Dwarika, and Maureen families of St. Patrick, Elaine Charles, Matthew Stephen and family, members of the Victoria and Guove Seventh day Adventist churches, and friends and neighbors of Moran, Gross Point, Cloger, and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Sybil Gulbin Matthew, also known as Mammy Naj of Moran St. John, will take place on Thursday, March 9th at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Guove Seventh day Adventist Church, and entombment will be at the Douglaston Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Matthias Herbert McIntyre, also known as Herbert Bridgman of Byland St. Andrew, died on Tuesday, 14 February 2023, at the age of 94, left to mourn his wife Anne Bridgman, children Louise, Lucy, Elsa and Dora Bridgman, all residing in Canada, Gail Bridgman in the USA, and Bernie Dubiset, Vicky Robertson, and Eric Bridgman, all in Grenada. Sister Margaret DeBellet in Grenada. Brother Morris Vincent in Jamaica. Nine grandchildren including Kira, Kaylee and Siobhan Bridgman, and Narlin Roberts, Nixon, and Erilyn Robertson. Five great-grands. Five sons-in-law including Clarence Dubiset and Errol Robertson. Caregivers Geraldine Phillip, Rhonda Francis, Suzanne Williams, and Sally Ann Andrew. Other relatives and friends including Kanasha Bridgman, Delma Thomas, Parliamentary Representative, Dr. Andy Bernard, Ronald Bridgman, Nurse Giselle Fletcher, Nurse Elwise Charles, the Bridgman and McIntyre families of Bylands, New Hampshire, and Paraclete, Cameron Douglas, parishioners of St. Matthew's R.C. Church and St. Michael's R.C. Church, and friends and neighbors of Bylands and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Matthias Herbert McIntyre, also known as Herbert Bridgman of Byland St. Andrew, will take place on Thursday, March 9th at 11 a.m. Funeral service will be held at the St. Matthew's R.C. Church Birch Grove, and interment will be at the Grand Bra Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Dwayne Dwight Cuffey of Belle Isle St. David, a former employee of the Ministry of Health, passed away on Thursday, February 9th, 2023, at the age of 36. He was the son of Telma Cuffey and Francis Klein, brother of Donlin, Donnell and Devon Cuffey, and Silma James in the USA, nephew of Elsia Thompson, Gloria, Sherma, David and Anthony Cuffey in Grenada, Junior, Gordon, Venny and Anthony Klein in the USA. Many other relatives and friends, including Derek Thompson and family, Bernard Joseph, Judy Ann Matheson, Keisha and Kelly Cuffey of Bellevue, Meve Hayes in the USA, Adina, Kimberly, Vanel and Vanessa Cuffey, Merlin Colvin and family, Nicole and Michelle Cambridge, and many other relatives and friends. The funeral of the late Dwayne Dwight Cuffey of Belle Isle St. David will take place on Thursday, March 9th at 1.30 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Church of the Immaculate Conception, Petit Esperance, St. David, and interment will be at the St. David Catholic Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Patricia Brenda Bernadine, née Francis, also known as Pat, of Upper Deperidine Street, Grove, St. John, passed away on Sunday, 12th February, 2023, at the age of 58, left to mourn her, her husband, Seton Bernadine, mother, Evelyn Francis, children, Jeremy, Gerald and Jordan Francis, Javied, 
Jabbery, and Jadine Bernadine. Siblings Claudia Francis, Sarah Francis Cariuk, Steve Francis, Leroy Francis, Chris Calica, and Jerry Nicholas. Grandchild PJ Elijah Alexander Bernadine. Other relatives and friends Cindy Modest, Princess Alexander, Jeanette Bernard, Hazel Ann Young, Jeanette Bernadine and family, Lorna Adams and family, June Harry and family, Gracelyn Frederick and family, Eunice St. Paul and family, Ma Louise George and family, Rosemary Charles and family, Lucia Aline and family, Kaisha Joseph and family, Hazel Mills and family, Ruthlyn and family, and Alice Sabazan, and friends and neighbors of Guove, Guove Estate, Moran, Cloji, and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Patricia Brenda Bernadine, née Francis, also known as Pat, of Upper Deperdeen Street, Guove, St. John, will take place on Thursday, March 9th at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the St. Peter's Catholic Church, Guove, and interment will be at the Douglaston Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Teresa Joan Norega, also known as Shoma, and Tanti of New Hampshire St. George, a former employee of East Women's Corporation, passed away on Sunday, 19th February. She was the wife of Robert Leonard Norega, mother of Mark and Trinidad, Marsha, Micah, Marsley, and Marcellus, grandmother of Mariela and Malika, step grandmother of Tiara, sister of Sharon Bridgman Scott, and Henry Timmy Bridgman in New York. Rona Burke in St. Vincent, Donna Bell in Bermuda, and Beverly Dawn Phillip. Aunt of many including Kent, Caleb, Turi, Monique, Lucas, Rurika Martin, Vashti, Marlon, and Tinik. Aunt-in-law of Abena, Melissa, Sunshine, Masemba, Stefan, Mandy, Dahlia, Mulegata, Aisha, Maxi, and Mayosi. Sister-in-law of Martin Scott, Oswald Burke, Elfred Peters, Kent Ball, Miguel Johnson, Michael Johnson, Desiree Bridgman, Melina Kwamina, Margot Johnson, and Christine Charles. Niece of many including Myrtle Placid, Amelia Greenwich, Alberta Valsin, Charles Nathaniel, Ellie and Dastan Morel, Dennis Tanker Bridgman, Samson, and Mandeville Paris. Many cousins, other relatives and friends including the Bridgman, Mackey, Edwards, Muriel, Williams families, Dr. Kate Mitchell, Nimrod Olive, Sheldon Scott, Andrew Donald, Mommy George, Miss Pink, Sister Lena and Twine, Miss Charles, Nurse Elva Edwards, the Northeast Women's Cooperation workers, friends and neighbors of New Hampshire and surrounding areas. The funeral service of the late Teresa Joan Norega, also known as Shoma and Tanti of New Hampshire St. George, a former employee of East Women's Corporation, will take place on Thursday, 9th March at 1 p.m. The funeral service will be held at the Wallace Memorial Church and the interment will be at the Family Cemetery, New Hampshire. Funeral arrangements have been entrusted to Lockwa Brothers Funeral Home. Clarice Redhead, also known as Kao of Cafe Kroshu St. Andrew, passed away on Thursday, 12 January, at the age of 86. She was the mother of Maureen Redhead Calice, Clinton Fraser, Dana Peters, Hazel and Cumberbatch, grandmother of 27 including Cridel, Rickson, Avion, Nafisha, Kada, Clinton, Clint, Katian, Kim, Tamika, Duan, Dwight, Omega, Marcus, Dunya, and Kenesha. Great grandmother of 17. Great great grandmother of two. Sister of Vincent Rubin and David Charles. Mother in law of Dunstan Calice. Cheryl and Twine. Philbert Peters and Kent James. Many nieces and nephews, including Matthew, Connie, Beverly, Michael, Delma, Elma, Meredith, Martin, Michelle, and Mitchie. Many other relatives and friends, including. Jelen McWilkin and family, Valerie Tellisford and family, Christine McIntosh and family, Velma Regis and family, Mabel Celestine and family, Joyce McIntosh and family, Marilda Bernard and family, Dessa Mason and family, Rose Felix and family, Gordon and family, Sean Elliott and family, Merlin St. Louis and family, Edris Blesdale, Neva and family, Claudia Mitchell and family, 
Carmen Mitchell and family, Benedict King and family, Jean Rubin and family, friends and neighbors of Kroshu and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Clarice Redhead, also known as Kao, of Cafe Kroshu St. Andrew, will take place on Thursday, 9th March at 12 noon. Funeral service will be held at the St. Martin de Porres Catholic Church, Kroshu St. Andrew, and interment will be at the Churchyard Cemetery. Funeral arrangements have been entrusted to Lacroix Brothers Funeral Home. Cradell Cerulea Francis of Café Crochu St. Andrew passed away on Tuesday, 28th February, 2023, at the age of 47. She was the mother of Delvon Fortune and Travis Redhead, grandmother of Navon Fortune, daughter of Maureen Redhead Caliste and Benedict Francis, stepdaughter of Dunstan Caliste and Jacqueline Francis, sister of Kester, Oscar, Wayne, Jimmy, Rickson, Ashe, Kevin, Candice, Aria, Clint, Clinton, and Kathy Ann, close and dear friend of Rafa Livingston, niece of Dana, Hazel, Laura, and Clinton Redhead. Many other relatives and close friends in Canada, the USA, and Grenada, including Noreen, Daphne, Beverly, Arita, Kanisha, Desiree, Rolda, Jillian, Jackie, Suzanne, Jesse, Tamika, Lorena, Valerie and family, Christine and family, Jillian and family, Culture and Decima, and friends and neighbors of Café, Croshu, and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Cradell Cerulea Francis of Café Croshu St. Andrew will take place on Thursday, March 9th at 12 noon. Funeral service will be held at the St. Martin de Porres Roman Catholic Church Croshu, and interment will be at the Churchyard Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Elizabeth Rouget, also known as Dora Noel of Munich, who resided at Rivulet Lane, Grenville St. Andrew, member of the Grenville Roman Catholic Mothers Union, passed away on Friday, 17th February 2023, at the age of 93. She was the mother of Desmond Lord, former teacher at the St. Andrew's RC School, grandmother of Darius Andrews, Deidre Andrews Date, Vanessa Gilbert, and Kazim Joseph, great grandmother of eight, sister of Mona Batiste and Hermelin Benjamin in Grenada, and Lucy Francis in the USA, aunt of many including Urban Mason, Kay, Barry, Sean, Anne, Gemma, Glenda, Wilfred, and Cynthia. Many other relatives and close friends including the Rouget and Noel families of Munich, Belle Isle in the USA and England, the Charles family of Happy Hill, the parish priest and parishioners of the Grenville Roman Catholic Church, members of the Mother's Union, the guys by Mr. Peter's shop and Maxie's bar, and neighbors and friends of Rivulet Lane, Grenville, and surrounding areas. The funeral service for the late Elizabeth Rouget, also known as Dora Noel of Munich, who resided at Rivulet Lane, Grenville, St. Andrew, will take place on Friday, March 10th at 2 p.m., Funeral service will be held at the Grenville R.C. Church and interment will be at the Grand Bra Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Isaac Nathaniel Peters, also known as Ian of Tempe St. George, a well-known businessman in the community, passed away on Friday, 17th February, at the age of 92. He was the loving husband of Veronica Peters, father of Gail Peters of Tempe, Pamela Gordon in the USA, Clive Peters of Monorouge and Ruby Holder in the UK, father-in-law of Robert Gordon in the USA, grandfather of Kale Peters, Olivia Durant, Warren Holder and Carl Holder, great-grandfather of Cleo and Renee, brother-in-law of Harry Harris, Edlyn Peters and Magrilia Alexander, many nieces and nephews including Dr. Richard Nixon, Alston Peters, Vaughn Nixon, Stanley, Althea Charles, Yulan Samuel, Grisling Gordon, and Evelyn Pridham, Grand Uncle of many in Grenada, the UK, Canada, and the USA. Many other close relatives and friends including Jeffrey Williams, Cicely Otway, Sarah Peters, Joel Peters and family, Kathleen Peters and family, the Japal family of Kroshu, Melissa Japal Rodney, the Otway family in Canada and Grenada, Margaret Harrison family, Michael and Judy Dean, the Ogilvy family in the UK, 
members of the Gospel Hall Assemblies of Grenada, friends and neighbors of Tempe and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Isaac Nathaniel Peters, also known as Ian, a well-known businessman in the community of Tempe, St. George, will take place on Monday, 13th March at 1 p.m. The funeral service will be held at the Garden of Remembrance Funeral Chapel, Cemetery Hill, St. George, according to Gospel Hall rites, and then two men will be at the St. George's Center Cemetery. Funeral arrangements have been entrusted to Lockwa Brothers Funeral Home. Evadne Mary Gill Alexander, also known as Vads, of Spring Garden, Birth Grove, St. Andrew, passed away on Monday, 20th February 2023, at the age of 71. Left to mourn are her siblings Wilma, Kenrick, Bernice, Roy, Perpetua, Cornelius, Francis, and Joseph. Son, Radon Gill. Daughter-in-law, Sheena Gill. Granddaughters, Angel and Shania Gill. Goddaughters, Juliet Forrester Garraway, Diane Jeffrey, and Alyssa David. Nieces and nephews, Jane, Pat, Rodney, Morgan, Kelvin, Dolland, Mosley, Berna, Griffith, Rachel, Amanda, Hillary, Queen Annie, Michael, Sean, Joel, Shane, and Erin. In-laws, Marilyn, Carol, Yvette, Judy, Jimmy, and Ron. Other relatives and friends, including Saga, Dick, Gemma Joseph, Sharon Wilfred, Emmeline Pear, Dorabella McIntyre, Esther and family, Magis and family, Denise Berkeley and family, Annette Noel and family, Monica and family, Victor Renault and family, the Ventor family of Bolio, the Roberts family, Pastor George Fletcher and the congregation of the New Testament Church of God, Birchgrove, and neighbors and friends of Birchgrove, Bylands, Monkthorn and surrounding areas, and Willis. The funeral of the late Evadne Mary Gill Alexander, also known as Vads, of Spring Garden, Birchgrove, St. Andrew will take place on Tuesday, 14th March, at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the New Testament Church of God, Birchgrove St. Andrew, and interment will be at the St. Rose Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Anthony McQueen, also known as Hillard Chambers, of Grand Roy, who resided at Upper Depredune Street, Grove St. John, passed away on Sunday, 5th March, 2023, at the age of 83. The funeral arrangements for the late Anthony McQueen, also known as Hillard Chambers of Grand Roy, who resided at Upper Depredine Street, Grove St. John, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Francis Bernard, also known as Cassie, of Grand Bacal at St. Andrew, passed away on Saturday, 4th March, 2023, at the age of 93. The funeral arrangements for the late Francis Bernard, also known as Cassie, of Grand Bacal at St. Andrew, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Rita Alexander, also known as Auntie Rita of Munich St. Andrew, who resided at Library St. George, passed away on Sunday, 26 February, at the age of 92. The funeral arrangement for the late Rita Alexander, also known as Auntie Rita of Munich St. Andrew, who resided at Library St. George, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements have been entrusted to Lacroix Brothers Funeral Home. Anthony Benedict Etienne, also known as Cess and Tony, of Lassager St. David, passed away on Saturday, 18 February 2023, at the age of 61. The funeral arrangements for the late Anthony Benedict Etienne, also known as Cess and Tony, of Lassager St. David, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Kenneth David Burke of 269 Woodland St. George passed away on Saturday, 25th February 2023 at the age of 86. The funeral arrangements for the late Kenneth David Burke of 269 Woodland St. George will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. Bernard Jerry George, also known as Plim and Black Boy, of Crochu St. Andrew, 
passed away on Saturday, 25th February 2023, at the age of 65. The funeral arrangements for the late Bernard Jerry George, also known as Plim and Black Boy, of Crochu St. Andrew, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lakwa Brothers Funeral Home. The management and staff of MTV extend deepest condolences to those of you whose loved ones have passed on. Thank you for watching. I am Godwill James, an MD and a member of Gateway Assembly. Medically, that is regarded as an end or a cessation of life. Different, um, different groups view death in different perspectives, while some regard death as a continuation of life, others view it as an infable form of life. As a Christian, we may want to view death as a separation of the soul from the body. So, Whichever way one may, view, one may view death, I want to say that may the gentle soul of the faithful departed rest in the bosom of the Lord. Amen. I am Godwill James, an MD and a member of Gateway Assembly. Medically, death is regarded as an end or a cessation of life. Various groups have different perspectives about, about death. While some view death as an infeeble form of life, others also regard it as a continuation of life. As a Christian, death is largely regarded as a separation of the soul from the body. So, whichever way one may want to view death, I want to say, that may the gentle soul of the departed rest in peace in the bosom of the Lord. Amen.